Hey guys, my name is Mark Scheme and welcome to my channel. So occasionally I do track days here and there and one of the requirements is you have to have tow hooks on your car. You know, in case you need to get towed. So this right here is my 2013 E92 335i. Uh, I'm going to show you guys how to install tow hooks on here. Now these are the new tow hooks I have for my car. These ones are solid aluminum ring with the metal stud that's going to go into your factory tow hook hole. Now, I used to run around with a nylon strap, but honestly, I didn't like this one very much. When you were driving around, it would just sit there and flap and hit your car, and honestly, I thought this one was kind of ugly, so I don't need this one anymore. Gone. Now, there's a lot of people that run around with the red tow hooks. I personally didn't like the style of that one. I wanted something that matched a little bit more of the color scheme of the car, which is white and black, so got some black tow hooks. Now to install these on the car, we're going to need a couple tools. One of them is a pocket screwdriver. Uh, every mechanic knows that you need a pocket screwdriver to fix anything. Well, we're going to use these to pry off the little covers on the car so that we can install the tow hooks on there. We're also going to need a 22 millimeter socket and ratchet to install the studs into the car. And we're also going to need a 19 millimeter wrench so that we can tighten the jam nuts down onto our tow hooks. That way, when they're installed, they don't sit there and flop around as we drive because we don't want them coming off as we're driving down the road. Let's go put these on. Alright guys, so now we're going to stow the tow hooks on the front of the car. So right here on the front right of my car, you see a little cover. Then you got a little washer fluid squirter things that squirt on the headlight. I still don't understand what those are for. Never in my life I've been, ah, oh, I need to wash my headlights. Well, anyway, here's the little cover. And what you're going to do is you're going to use your little pry tool. Go in the bottom corner, pry that right out. The little cover comes off. Hides a little hole. I don't know if you can see that or not, but that's where the stud is going to go for your new tow hook. Now, I try not to scratch these up because I put them back on. When I'm done at the track, I like to take my tow hooks back off. I'm not one of those guys that like to drive around with my tow hook on, but it's your choice. Do what you want. Now, what you're going to do is you're going to take your stud, you're going to screw that right into that hole. Tighten that down. Want to make sure that doesn't come off. And then take your little ring and just screw it all the way on. And then once you get it in a position you like, which I like to have mine hanging down like that, you're just going to take the jam nut, tighten that down. There. And then, there you go, front one's installed. Uh, we'll go to the back and we'll do the same thing on the back one, which is pretty exactly the same thing. Alright, we're here at the back of the car. We're going to do pretty much the same exact thing. So the little cover right here, we're just going to go ahead and pry that off. Save my little cover again. Ring on. And then just tighten the jam nut down and then you got tow hooks on your car. You're ready to race. Hey guys, done for today. Thanks for watching my video. If you like what you saw, smash the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. That way when I post my next video, you guys will know. And go ahead and leave your comment down below. Let me know how what you think. And if you want to follow me on Instagram, I post there from time to time. Thank you guys. I'll see you next video.